Hi there, it's Ron Gula. And Cindy Gula. And we are here to announce the winners of our fall 2023 cybersecurity competition for nonprofits in support of Pillar 1 and Pillar 2 of the National Cybersecurity Strategy. So our Pillar 1 winners were Shadow Server Foundation winning $300,000 and ICS Village awarding $200,000. And Pillar 2, which is for the disruption of threat actors, $300,000 being awarded to the Internet Fire Brigade, and $200,000 is being awarded to Intelligence for Good. That's a million dollars that we hope is going to go to help protect the country and support the national cybersecurity strategy. Now let's hear from the organizations themselves. Hi everyone, my name is Don Van Norman, one of the co-founders of the ICS Village. I'm joined here tonight with one of our key volunteers, Sean Siraj, uh, to accept an award from uh, the Gula Tech Foundation. Uh, ICS Village, we've been around for about 10 years now. Uh, we are focused on uh, industrial control system security. And Sean here would like to say a few words. Yeah, absolutely. So uh, again, uh, big thanks to the Gula Tech Foundation for supporting us with this grant. Uh, we're going to take these funds and put it towards some workforce development work to really get after and support the pillar one of the national cybersecurity strategy. Um, what we've identified here at ICS Village is essentially a big Rubicon between very skilled practitioners in industrial automation uh, and also the cybersecurity skills that we're going to need to try to protect critical infrastructure. So our goal over here is to get curriculum out there, uh, develop apprenticeship programs, and uh, get those skilled workers uh, after our national security endeavors. I'd also like to invite everybody to our own conference, uh, Hack to Capital, be held in Washington, D.C. Uh, around May 2024. Uh, we will have a day of training. We will also be rolling out our workforce development initiative. Check out icsvillage.com uh, for more information as we get closer. Sign up. Hope to see everyone there. Thanks, guys. Thank you. Hi everyone, uh, I'm Todd Everly. I'm the Alliance Director at the Shadow Server Foundation. Uh, we are a 501c3 nonprofit organization here in the United States. Um, our goal is to uh, make the internet safer for, for everyone, and we do that uh, a number of ways. Um, primarily, we collect cyber threat data uh, through a variety of means. Um, we have our own data center in California. Um, we run scanning operations on a daily basis. We have Honeypot sensor network uh, with sensors throughout the world. Um, we operate sinkholes. Uh, we assist law enforcement uh, in investigations and collect uh, data through, through uh, those investigations. And we share that out, all this data out with um, 8,000 organizations across the globe every day, free of charge. Um, we also provide that data to uh, national uh, certs in 176 countries. Um, we do have a presence, uh, quite a presence in the United States. So 56% of the IP space uh, in the U.S. takes our data. We're hoping to expand on that. Um, in particular, I'd like to say thank you to the Gula Tech Foundation uh, for uh, naming us a recipient of the uh, uh, Gula Tech Foundation uh, 2023 grant competition. Um, we are grateful to, to receive these funds. We want to utilize these funds to uh, focus uh, even more on the United States, um, particularly in, with uh, respect to critical infrastructure. Uh, as everyone knows, critical infrastructure is under attack now more than ever, and uh, it's very important that we work with uh, critical infrastructure um, organizations and helping them to strengthen their, their networks and defend against attacks. Um, so uh, if uh, you would like to learn more about the Shadow Server Foundation, please go to our website. Uh, at shadowserver.org. Um, also, uh, about a year ago, we started the Shadow Server Alliance. So we're partnering with uh, uh, companies and uh, universities and uh, governments and national certs uh, through our alliance. Um, it's helping to foster uh, closer collaboration on uh, different types of projects. So uh, please consider uh, checking out our website and uh, and uh, joining the uh, Shadow Server Alliance. 
Um, so thank you again to the Gula Tech Foundation and in particular to Ron and Cindy Gula uh, for supporting this foundation, uh, which uh, allows us to continue uh, the work that we're doing. So thank you very much. Hi, I'm Robin Pugh and I'm with Intelligence for Good. We are so excited to be one of the recipients of a Gula Tech Foundation grant in support of the national cybersecurity strategy. We're related to Pillar 2, so we want to tell you a little bit more about what we're doing here at Intelligence for Good. Gary? So Pillar 2 is disrupting and dismantling threat actors. And one of the problems that we recognize in the work that we do in our day jobs is that there are a lot of problems that don't have a natural predator. If somebody's attacking the bank with a phishing site, the bank kind of has a responsibility to deal with that. But so many of our victims, especially our elderly scam victims, are being attacked by people that don't have a natural predator. So many of these that we're going to be going after have to do with uh, things in the crypto investment scams, romance scams, the tech support scams that are especially targeting our elderly. And we've got some great tools that we use for our other customers that we're going to be applying in this space. But the place we're going to start is going after business email compromise. And uh, Ronnie, why don't you take that? Sure. Uh, over the last eight years, we've been quietly working behind the scenes to get ahead of this business email compromise problem. We've collaborated with banks. We've collaborated with law enforcement. We've collaborated with grandparents. Um, and again, that's one of those things where we will collaborate with anybody we can because this is one of the largest problems that, that are out there. For the last seven years, uh, BEC has been the number one cyber crime, and we're looking to kind of ramp up a lot of those efforts in order to start getting ahead of the way that we combat the fraud, in order to continue working with the banks, in order to continue working with victims, in order to help get ahead of a lot of the way that this stuff works. So with Intelligence for Good, that's one of the things we're looking to do is uh, start ramping up those efforts and kind of sticking it to the scammers, if you will. So. So thank you again to Gula Tech Foundation. We hope you'll check out our website. We're at intelligenceforgood.org. Learn more about what we're doing and how you can get involved. Thank you. Hi, my name is Matt Lassell. I'm with Internet Fire Brigade. Uh, and we're an organization that brings uh, industry uh, and, and government together to collaborate. Uh, Internet Fire Brigade. Uh, won the uh, Gula Tech Venture uh, grant, and we want to say thank you. Um, with uh, the grant, it's going to enable industry uh, and uh, the Pillar 2.2 uh, of the National Cyber Strategy uh, to bring industry and information together. That's going to enable protecting the internet, industry, and the critical infrastructure of the United States um, to have information and to work together in a neutral way. Um, Google Tech Adventures has brought many organizations together uh, and that's enabled the internet to be safer. Uh, and we're looking forward to do a lot of work to protect yourself and everyone else that is part of the internet community. Wow, that was great. I hope you learned something. And thank you very much for visiting the page. If you want to learn more about the previous five grants, please visit Gula.Tech Foundation page. Congratulations again to all the winners. And we hope this is an inspiration to anybody who works in cybersecurity and wants to get in cybersecurity. Thank you.